हेलो गाइस, आई एम बैक विथ अनदर वीडियो ऑफ चाउमी मी थ्री दिस टाइम द न्यूएस्ट वर्जन ऑफ म्यू आई दैट्स म्यू आई वर्जन सिक्स आई जस्ट वॉक वॉक थ्रू इट सो लेट स्टार्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल द इम्प्रेशन इज दैट दिस इज काइंड ऑफ आई एस सेवन लुक अलाइक सो आई वोंट पोस्ट मच अबाउट दैट सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द रियल म्यू आई फीचर्स आई स्टिक विद स्टिक दैट दिस इज कम्प्लीटली म्यू आई एंड दैट्स new theming first thing you will notice is that there are tons of animations just look here when i slide up the icons just come like comes like that so that's and i'll show you some another i mean if i put on charging so you will get now this animation so it's like there are so many others like i'll show you one music player Okay, let's see. Mm. Let's go with this. Okay. So, if you just click on this, it will go back like this. So that's a nice thing, and you have the features like swipe right to for lyrics. Uh, there are no lyrics for this because. Okay. So that's a good thing. The. and you can see over here the clock widget the there that's blinking so that's a good thing mm. okay now let's switch to the status bar as you can see there are so many changes in the status bar earlier you used to get the music music so here music menu now it's shifted to the right side and uh, if you want to start you have to click over here and you might be able to notice the orange bar that the orange bar is showing the music the time of the music which is completed like the complete circle is 100% obviously so that much part is been completed and now you can scroll through this so that's a good thing but i didn't find the option that we had earlier that we get these these menus over here which we had in miui 5 so that's but that's okay that's not an uh, that's not any issue and uh, the another thing is the all the icons as you can see all the stock icons are completely flattened means they have completely new look uh, that looks good feels good uh, good for eyes so that's a good thing and uh, there is one more thing added now if you swipe from this like from home screen you can search over here for applications or uh, you can search anything in the settings like let search battery so you it will show battery indicator which battery indicator suppose i want percentage i want graphical so that's like android help feature which is going to come it's again they have got it earlier only uh, if i want to load settings okay, that's some if i want to load settings then it will load into settings so as you can see the settings menu is completely changed all the icons it's white it's in white and black background the icons of all these are pretty good and they look pretty good because of the 1080p display that we are having right now so that's a good thing then uh now we open suppose we open this open this and now if we go to the recent apps menu if you if you just pinch in or pinch out so that's getting locked If you pinch out, then you get this. I don't know if <laughs> I won't. <laughs> okay, that that's iOS 7 look alike again, but that's okay. If you want to stick to this, then okay. So that's a good thing. And uh, in the settings menu now, you get two different install apps and system apps. In the system apps, you can see that security. We know, we all know the security app. So there are various settings for security app. Uh, okay you can go through it later gallery suppose music we want to music download while streaming all the settings which you had to for which you had to go into the specific app and then change the settings now you can go into say, uh, system apps and just change it like notes uh, alarms in silent mode if you want that i don't want that so i'll cancel that so that's a good thing uh so as i said security app let's go into security app and uh it it's i'll say it's newly themed but uh, 
it it has many other features uh, increased feature i would say uh, like uh, if we go into settings mm, no, not this okay if we go into settings you will see that the cleaner app the cleaner app has extend expand the cache groups or various settings various the the deepness of the app has increased i would say and uh, first of all when i installed this um, ui 6 i it wasn't possible for me to uh, install a custom launcher i don't know why but i uninstalled it and installed it again i installed it uh, by backing it up so if i go to default app settings uh, then i can get the google now launcher too as you can see over here right now i'll just stick to mui right now so this is the our uh, normal app and uh, if earlier we had in mui 5 we had the ring if we slide it up then we get camera off or slide it here messaging slide down to now we are only slide up to unlock and we have another feature like slide left for the camera app uh so now talking about the camera app uh the new feature is uh, i'll focus over here so if i focus over here i don't need to go here and click that's okay if we do that but if we focus here we can do that if i double tap it will click a photo so that's a good thing so now the gallery app now uh, in gallery app all the all the images are sorted by date if you slide right the local images like whatsapp images or the movies or anything all the folders which are on the on your sd card so that will be shown if you go into local so another feature is that if you swipe down from anywhere like if i swipe down from here the notification bar will come out so as we, we have this fine screen it's it's not always possible to go here and then take the it down you can just do this from anywhere yeah like if i do this then the then the notification bar will come out and i'll show you this music app if you open music app like I'll, i'll just close it right now if you open music app this will be shown the first of all you will see this online bar and then the local bar so you can download online music for free as i have shown in another another video i'll leave the i'll leave the annotation over here if this is the video so okay so the next thing is that you get this badge the number of messages uh, like i have one message in the whatsapp so that will have badge like voice search that that's google so this is the this is it so it will show a badge so that's a good thing that you without opening the app you will get to know about that and the new thing is if you long press nothing will come out to move the icons to move the icons you will have to pinch in uh, i'll just pinch in and then move apps widgets small paper effects extra effects i expected many other effects to come in but there are only this this many maybe this is alpha build that's why it's and uh, these were all the good things that were possible with this now i'll talk with some things which we, which are missing from ui5 maybe this is an alpha build that's why they are missing maybe they'll add they'll they'll add later if you know that uh, some of the things which i am going to talk about right now are working then do comment in the comment section below i'll surely take them into consideration so now i'll show you first if i go into a recent app tray if i click over here it won't exit the recent app tray which used to do earlier earlier version like new wifi then uh, if you receive any message then so if the circle is there then you cannot uh, slide up means that you have to try uh, four or five times to get get through the unlock screen otherwise you can just uh, click on the message and then slide up so that's but that's okay that's not an issue much of an issue so as and now you can see if for recent app tray i have to click on option i'll just i'll just pin it out so multitasking is good miui version 6 had surely increased the battery for at least for me so that's not an issue if you do this then for this i have to press the option key if i long press the home key nothing will happen 
and I cannot change this like uh, if I single press setting option button to uh, to like show options so that's not possible like if I go in suppose I go in music player let's go in music player and I go to uh, this track earlier I used to if I press option button then I used to get options like edit song information download lyrics etc etc now that's not possible maybe this is an alpha build that's why the option is missing but it will come out later so let's hope for that and uh, the, one of the main feature was that the WIW LAN which will store your uh, Wi-Fi something something uh, I didn't find that option anywhere if you guys know where the option is hidden or somewhere like that do comment comment about that and uh, earlier we had this option if we go into permission permissions and then suppose I entered authority, I trust this app then I can I could use the trust this app so all the permissions are granted but currently that's missing so I don't know why they removed it that was a good option and uh, uh, one of the most disappointment was that if I slide if I add over here and add a widget suppose let's no 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 I add calendar widget okay so if i add this then no longer this this screen doesn't remain my home screen this can here i come when i press home so that's an annoying issue if you know solution for any of this do comment guys i'll surely add this at that so this was it for the mi ui 6 uh, i'll say i'll surely say that the battery life has uh, increased uh, more or less for me uh, the, some of, for some of the guys, the battery life they are saying is not good because that's pre-alpha build but battery life has increased, the performance has increased, the multitasking is smooth, no issue over there. So that's a good thing to for me UI 6, I am looking forward for the stable build. So that's it for this video guys, if you have any doubts regarding me UI 6, do comment in the comment section below, I'll surely get to it. Uh, thank you guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you're subscribed to my channel and follow me on Google Plus for other videos to stay updated with my other videos. Thank you guys.